Former rookie cop on trial for rape faces his accuser today in court. Two years ago, the woman says Leesburg police officer Henry LaRue made a detour on the way to jail and took advantage of her. LaRue maintains he is innocent. Washington News is not identifying the alleged victim. Washington News Gail Pasco Brown has the latest from the Lake County Courthouse. He was smart. He knew what he was doing. The woman accusing former Leesburg police officer Henry LaRue of rape took the stand today in his trial on October 3rd, two years ago. 25 year old LaRue pulled over the then 23 year old woman for having a tail light out. She was arrested for having a suspended license. On the way to jail, she claims LaRue took her behind a strip mall and forced her to commit a sex act. He had pulled up my shirt and my bra and then grabbed my breasts. The jurors, mostly women, listened as she demonstrated what allegedly happened. In and out of handcuffs. He had this really creepy smile on his face, like um, he just won the World Series and said, I couldn't believe you actually did it, and laughed. And then he put me back in the car. He made comments on the way to the Lake County Jail how he couldn't wait to see me again, and he had my address and my phone number from the police report. LaRue has maintained the allegations are false. He knows in the end that right will prevail and he will be vindicated. On the stand, the alleged victim also testified that once she was brought to the Lake County Jail, she didn't tell anyone anything. I told no police officer that I came in contact with that night about it. I had no trust for any of them. Their uniforms were a different color, but they're all a union. You know, they were all one to me at that point in time. I did not tell anybody at the jail. I told my mother when I got home. She said the same night of the alleged incident, her mother called state and federal authorities. The media was also contacted. No, I wanted to make sure it was public and that there would be people watching their moves so they can't cover it up, so that he can't get away with what he did. The alleged victim's mother took the stand next. Court resumes tomorrow morning. I'm Gail Pascal Brown in Lake County for West 2 News.